learning about it. Today we will be learning about installing Webmin on my CentOS platform system. I have already downloaded the RPM package, but if you like to download, you can get to the source link. I have provided the link on the descriptions. You can do this get and the link followed by the link to download the package to the current current working directory right now I'm not doing this I've already downloaded the package now for the installation we have also we also need to download the dependency the dependencies are Paul and this other stuff also we need open SSL this will take a couple of minutes to install as my internet is slightly weak Now all the dependencies are already installed now we can install the package itself for this we can use rpm command followed by hyphen u followed by the name of the package followed by the name the package is already downloaded as provided in the link before Now the package is installed, it says that we can browse the given link to open the webmin to get access to the webmin web portal and right now I'll copy this. Let's minimize the terminal. Open Firefox. Paste the link. And it says a error the secure connection menu is related to SSL as I my system is not configured to provide secure service. We need to disable this SSL related SU. It doesn't solve without secure connection. So in the webmin installation configuration, I need to disable this SSL. since I need to find which is the configuration file so let's look at all the configuration files in the etc slash webmin itself I can see there miniserve.conf which is the required file to configure the server configuration part of the webmin let's edit that file let's find something called SSL equals to I can find it down here okay since it says SSL equals to 1 to enable I will change it to zero to disable it now save the file now restart the webmin service itself okay it's done it's started and it's had loaded the new configurations let's refresh the page okay it's working let me check how what will what will happen if I log in with my local account it doesn't allow me we have to log in from the root 
I'll give the root username and my password and done. I can configure all the options. The Waveman is a very great tool for the system administrators to confirm, to configure the Linux systems.